Hello, welcome back to another Python 3.7 tutorial. My name's Tom with Master Code Online. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. In today's tutorial, we're going to take a look at the is disjoint uh, set method in Python. Basically, what the is disjoint set method does is it returns true when two sets are compared to each other that don't contain the same exact objects in them. All right, it will return false if it does contain the same object in each set all right so let's go ahead and take a look at this um so you guys better understand what i'm talking about we'll create two sets a will represent the first set we'll do one two three and four and the second set is going to be represented by b so we'll do uh four but oh no let's not do four let's do five six seven and eight all right and like i said when these two sets are compared to each other using the is disjoint string method it string method set method i just want to keep saying string method uh, set method, um, when we compare the two of them together, um, if they don't have the same objects, it's going to return true. And if they do contain the same objects, they're going to return false. So just looking at these two sets, we can see that they do not contain the same um, objects in them. So when we call the is disjoint uh, set method, we're going to go ahead and um, get a true return to us. So a dot is disjoint method, and we'll call b. And we get true, right? Like I said, they don't have the same object. Now let's go ahead and create another set, and that would be represented by C. And we'll go ahead and do 8, 9, 10, and 11. And basically, what this uh, does is it's what I'm trying to say is these two have the same object. So when we call the is disjoint uh, method, we're going to go ahead and get um, a false return to us. So let's go ahead and do uh, B dot is this joint oops, um, C. All right, so we're passing C is the argument and we get false because they contain the same objects. All right, so that's the gist of the is disjoint string method or set method. Damn, I said it again. Uh, anyhow, uh, if we can only pass one argument to this, so we can't do A is this joint and call B and C because that just will not work. It's just showing it takes exactly one argument. All right, so that is the is this joint set method in Python. If you have any questions, please let me know over at mastercode.online or below in the YouTube comments. I'll see you in the next tutorial.